YouTube. Um, today I have been told there is Magispect support, so um, look really look forward to this. Um, Magispect is one of my my most favourite decks. Um, it got me got me into competitive Yu-Gi-Oh. So let's look at the support. Um, Magispect Porcupine, um, Wind Spellcaster, Pendulum Effect, uh, 1500 attack, 1500 defense. During the main phase, if you control a Magispect monster, quick effect, you can special summon this card from your hand. If uh, second effect, if this card is normal summoned or special summoned, you can target one Magispect spell in your graveyard and set it. Cannot be destroyed by battle by your opponent's card effects, or and your opponent cannot target this card. Oh, Magispect has got a extender now. That's really good. Um, you can normal summon Bombuku uh, and search Porcupine and then special summon it and then make Beyond the Pendulum or something. So yeah, that's really good for Magispectors. Magispector Draco. Win, uh, win Spellcaster XE Pendulum Effect. Uh, rank 4, 2300 attack, 2000 defense. Pendulum Effect. You can only use this Pendulum Effect of this card's name once per turn. If you have a Magic Spectre or Draco Slayer card in your Pendulum Zone, you can add one Magic Spectre card from your deck to your hand, then destroy one card in your Pendulum Zone. That's really, really good. Um, you can search like Bombuku, um, Fox, um, Cat, or Ogama. So yeah, that's really good. Um, monster Effect. Two level four monsters. If If you can Pendulum Summon... Level four, a uh, level four. You can pendulum summon this this face up card from your extra deck. Um, you can only use the first monster effect of this card's name up to twice per turn. If a monster is tributed while this card is on the field, you can detach one material from this card. Special summon one level six or lower wind spellcaster monster from your deck. Um, second effect: if this card is in the monster zone. Is destroyed by battle or by card effect or tributed, you can place it in your pendulum zone. Uh, so the first effect is really good. Um, you're always tributing your Magic Spectres for like Tempest, Tornado, or Majesty's Pegasus. And the fact that um, you can special summon one level six or lower Wind Spellcaster, maybe uh, Magic Spectre Unicorn Kieran could come back. Um, really looking forward to this. Really good. Um, and the fact that if it's destroyed by battle or by card effect or tributed, you can place in your pendulum zone. So the XE monster um, is really good. Um, and the fact that Kieran may be coming back. So yeah. Um, oh, Magispect has got a link monster. Magispect, Authorist New. Wind Spellcaster, Link Effect. Attack 1500, Link 2, bottom left, bottom right. Two pendulum monsters, including a Magispect monster. You can only use this, uh, you can only use the effect of this card's name once per turn. If this card is linked summoned, you can activate this effect. You can you cannot special summon monsters from the extra deck for the rest of the turn except Magic Spectre and Draco Slayer monsters. Also, add up to two face-up Magic Spectre Pendulum monsters from your extra deck to your hand. Then you can add up to two Magic Spectre Pendulum monsters with different names from each other from your deck to your extra deck face-up. Um, so yeah, this card is really good. Um, the fact that you could, when uh, you make it, you get your scales back. So, for example, if you go normal summon Bombuku, um, add Porcupine, then special summon Porcupine, make um, the link to, and then uh, put Magis, uh, like Fox and, and Ogama in your extra deck, uh, extra deck sorry. Um, you can add uh, Bombuku and Porcupine back to your hand. And you get full scales. Plus, when you pendulum summon the fox and toad, you can get a tempest and tornado. Uh, this card is really good. Um, so hyped for this card. Um, so yeah. Um, uh, quick play spell, magic specter wind. Quick play spell. You can activate one cards with this names once per turn. When you activate this card, you can also tribute one Wind Spellcaster, special summon one Magic Spectre monster from your hand or graveyard. Or if you tributed a monster at activation, you can special summon it from your deck instead. Um, 
Mash specters now have an emergency teleport. Um, you can special summon Bombuku from deck, so you can normal summon Crow, um, add Mash Specter Wind, and get um, Mash Specter Bombuku from the deck, and then Bombuku will get um, the new level four extender, um, and then you make the new Link Two monster, the Mash Specter Link Two. I'm so hyped for this um, support. Um, really good overall. Um, I'm going to go and make a deck list now that um, plays the new Magic Specter support. Magic Specter is one of my favorite decks. So, yeah. In the next part of the video, I will show you uh, my Magic Specter deck going forward post the new support. So, yeah. This is my Magic Specter deck profile post the new support um, that I've been testing and have really enjoyed playing this list. Um, so, I play three Majesty's Pegasus. Uh, the Draco Slayer. This one's on Pendulum Summon, also summoned by Draco Slayer Effect, which is your Secret Village, which is your win con of the deck. Um, then I play three Magic Spectre Porcupine. Um, this is the new extender. Um, so if you have any Magic Spectre monster, uh, Fox, Ogama, um, Crow, or Bobuku, or Cat, you can switch some of this from hand. So it's really good to get into the link too. Um, three Fox, uh, this one searches your Tornado and Tempest. Um, Toad searches your Tornado, Tempest and Cyclone and your Magic Specter Wind. Um, so you play three of all, all of the Magic Specters. Three Crow, um, this searches Cyclone and uh, Magic Specter Wind. Um, three Wombuku, um, the best card in the deck, searches uh, all of the Magic Specters and one cat because it's good to search on the end phase um, you could play two more cat if you really wanted to but um but yeah um i play three ash because it's good generically three Vela, good generically i need hand traps along with three imperm um you could play droll uh because droll um can start your plays going especially if you have like mashies pegasus or mash back to wind with droll because uh, Droll is a wind spellcaster and um, and Majesty's uh, Magis Magis Pegasus only requires a wind spellcaster to tribute to summon Bobbuku from deck. And the same with Magic to Wind. All you have to do is tribute summon a wind spellcaster. So yeah, uh, three, three Pot of Prosperity for consistency. Uh, one Cyclone because you can tribute a wind spellcaster and destroy a monster your opponent controls. Uh, three Magic Specter Wind, um, you tribute a Wind Spellcaster and summon a Magic Specter from deck. Also, you can um, special summon a card from ha a Magic Specter from Hand or Grave. So yeah, uh, when one Secret Village um, stops your opponent activating spell cards like Dark Ruler, Lightning Storm, Harvest Feather Dust, you control a uh, Spellcaster, which uh, pretty much all the monsters are apart from Ash Blossom. Or Majesty's Pegasus because you can uh, search it off Majesty Maiden. You could play two if you really want to, but one's been working really well. Um, you and you basically you tribute one Wind Spellcaster to special summon their Majesty Spectre from deck. Um, three Imperm, good generically. Two Tornado, uh, you tribute a Wind Spellcaster and banish a monster your opponent controls, and one Majesty Spectre Tempest because uh, you it's basically summon strike uh, for the extra deck. One Zeus. Pretty standard. Uh, two match for Draco. Um, I was going to play three, but two seemed pretty fine. Um, one Baguska, plan B. One Dweller, just in, uh, good against graveyard decks like Unchained and Salaman Grey and Burning Abyss and other graveyard decks. One Totenberg, because you can make it with uh, Magic Spectre von Buku and Cat. One Access Co Code Talker to end games. One Nightmare Unicorn for it's good generically. One Selene, because uh, you can, most of the monsters are spellcasters, so then you can make access code. One Nightmare Phoenix to write anti spell and problematic back row. Uh, one SP Little Knight, this is the new card out of Age of Overlord. Um, three of the Magic Spectre Link 2, this card's really good. Uh, play One Beyond the Pendulum, uh, this card's really good. Um, other cards you could play is a small Draco Slayer package. Um, Draco Slayers are really good, especially with Bombuku and Majesty's Pegasus. So that's yeah, something um, you can consider. Um, you could um, up the number of uh, Magic Spectre Cat as well if you really want to. Um, 
Uh, you can play also, there was no room for Daniel Magician and Fortune Tune. Um, that's another um, option you could play in your extra deck to make Zeus, uh, Form Tier of Zeus. Uh, Ties of the Brethren, uh, another good option. Magic Sonic's another good option. You could play more Field Spell or Tornado and Tempest. Uh, these are some suggestions you could play in the deck. But yeah. All right. Thank you for watching the video. Um, this has been my Magic Specter uh, draft one of the deck. Um, I'm going to continue testing this deck. Um, I'm so happy with the new support. I'm so hyped to play it as well when it comes out. So yeah. Thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe and stay tuned for more content. Cheers.